Hey guys, and welcome to your love reading for Pisces. So this is going to be for your February 2023. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus sign. So this reading is for the Piscean individuals that are uh, possibly entertaining the idea of wanting to reconcile with an ex or an ex wanting to reconcile with you or both of you guys are looking for that. So we're going to take a look and see what the mutual energies between you and your ex are. Uh, what caused the separation and then we'll finish off the read to see if there's going to be a reconciliation between you two so apply this to your own unique situation you can switch the roles if you want keep in mind that these are general messages take what resonates and leave the rest behind if this message didn't resonate with you take a look at your other placements um uh, what else uh keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective pisces people so i'm not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular so if you're looking for a reading um tailored to your specific unique situations and your energies i suggest you to book a personal reading with me the link for that is in the description box below also like share comment subscribe uh, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when I go live, okay? All right, let's get started. So tell me about Pisces and their ex. What are the mutual energies between Pisces and their ex for February 2023? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. Even though I'm asking about the mutual energies, you guys, it could be a situation that only one of you guys are feeling this way, okay? So just apply this to your own unique situation. Five of Swords here in the Six of Wands. Whoever this is, this individual in particular is confident about winning you back. Okay? Yeah, I, I do feel like there's someone in particular that wants to win you back here. Because I feel like this is you here, Pisces, with this Nine of Pentacles here. And this is the person that you're dealing with here. Page of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. Six of Cups and a Queen of Wands here. So someone here wants you back, Pisces. Someone here wants you back. I do feel like someone here is coming in with some sort of communication here. This is an individual that's coming in fast and quick. Whoever this is, this person is very cocky and arrogant. I do feel like their arrogance might get the best of them because I feel like you might not even want this person back. Knight of Swords. The Sun. Leo Energy. Knight of Swords, Leap or Aquarius, Gemini. Seven of Cups and a Nine of Swords. Seems like they were exploring other options out there and I feel like it overwhelmed them or it stressed them out. Or that, you know, these other options were not giving your vibes, you know? Or that this individual is not vibing with those individuals. Someone here is definitely looking for a reconciliation here. Some of the pentacles here and the lovers, Gemini energy. I mean, you could be thinking about this to see if you want to give this person another chance here, uh, uh, Pisces. Yeah, we have someone here that cannot stop thinking about this connection. Eight of Swords and the Two of Cups. Let's see what else we have. What caused the separation here between uh, Pisces and their ex? What caused the uh, separation here between Pisces and their ex for February 2023? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. The Emperor, Aries Energy. The Tower, Aries Scorpio. Two of Pentacles and the Page of Cups. 
the magician here in the seven of wands this page is this emperor here yeah I, I feel like this individual blew this connection up yeah perhaps by going out there and juggling you exploring other options you know what the page of cups here and the two of pentacles cancer scorpio pisces Aries Scorpio energy with the tower, Aries energy with the emperor here. Could be dealing with a low vibing emperor here. Yeah, uh, the magician here in the seven of the wands. It seemed like this person pulled you close to them and then pushed you away, pulled you close to them and pushed you away. And I feel like this person kept doing that. I do feel like this person was trying to control you or trying to manipulate you or that this person felt like you were easy to manipulate so I feel like that's why this person is so cocky and arrogant that they're coming back thinking that they could win you back yeah don't give this person that status that that satisfaction Pisces prove this person wrong yeah reclaim your power the Emperor two of cups the tower four of cups seems like this person had everything in this connection but they got bored here they got bored and I feel like that's why they were out there exploring other other options or they were juggling you they were telling you that they were making friends out there but I feel like it I, I feel like it was more it, it, it could have been more if it was not romantic it was more like sexual page of cups nine of cups ten of, uh, two of pentacles and a ten of wands you know, I'm feeling like this is an energy of someone here wanting their cake and eat it too. I feel like this person saw you as their wish fulfillment, but I feel like this person also wanted to go out there and explore other options. I also feel like this is an individual that's incredibly selfish. Yeah, just really thinking about themselves here and not thinking how their actions could hurt you. The Magician. We have the Four of Swords, the Seven of Wands here, and the Two of Swords. I feel like this person was trying to block prosperity here with you. It seems like this person can come off very cold and very distant here. So I feel like, you know, I feel like there was a bit of a kind of back and forth because I feel like sometimes this person could be, you know, very warm, very nurturing, you know, very engaging. And then the next moment they're not. Let's see, will there be reconciliation between Pisces and their ex? Will there be reconciliation between Pisces and their ex for February 2023? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Pisces. Queen of Swords here and Judgment, I don't think there will be. Uh, the Fool and the uh, Knight of Cups. Three of Cups here and the Five of Wands. You don't trust this person. You've leveled up here. You know, I feel like you've come to that realization or you awaken to the fact that this person, you know, might not change or that they're going to do it again. Okay, so Queen of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, Judgment, Sagittarius, Energy, and the Empress, Libra, Taurus. You know, I feel like you're trying to be smart about this. Let's say if this masculine is coming back for reconciliation, you don't trust it. The Fool, Aries Energy, and the Knight of, uh, Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. And the Three of Cups here and the Five of Wands. I, I feel like this person will continue to go out there and meet other people here. This is going to cause a conflict. It's just going to be the same thing. You know this. Yeah, it's just better off to go off and start a new beginning here and look for love elsewhere than to deal with this again. Uh, the Fool, Knight of Pentacles, Knight of Cups, and the Hermit. So Pisces, I feel like you're taking action to do some soul searching or that you're taking action just to completely distance yourself from this individual here with the Hermit, Virgo energy. Three of Cups, the Ten of Cups, Five of Wands, and the World. Yeah, uh, I do feel like this masculine does want a reconciliation, but I just feel like you're closing this out. This person is obsessed with you. They want to regain control of you, but like I said, don't give this person the satisfaction. Yeah, don't give this person the satisfaction that they can win you back so easily. 
because you're easy to manip manipulate. I just don't feel like you're going to allow this to happen anymore. We have the king to queen of wands, okay? Emperor to empress here. This is a true pair. This could be a karmic connection here, but I just feel like you're closing this out, Pisces. So Pisces, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video, like this video if you haven't done so yet, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll speak to you guys in the next one. All right, thanks guys, bye.